Hello and welcome to Florida Focus. I'm Leali Shalebi. A new study out of the University of South Florida is raising awareness about systemic racism in the Tampa Bay area. Reporter Haley Zarcon is in St. Pete to explain what the study found. The study came out just before St. Pete hosted their annual Martin Luther King Jr. events. Crowds marched in front of a landmark that represents injustice. Black families were pushed out of this neighborhood where they lived for decades to make room for the Tropicana Field. The gas plant uh, was a neighborhood where the Tropicana Field now sits, where the rays are. Um, and a lot of those people were displaced, right? And their descendants are, you know, go to the local high schools here and they don't have, you know, a chance in hell of becoming property owners. The research was commissioned by the city as voters elected St. Pete's first black mayor. The study looked into policies and practices that were made as a result of systemic racism. The city council joined cities across the U.S. this past summer in declaring racism a public health crisis. In St. Pete, I'm Haley Zarcone, reporting for Florida Focus. The American Academy of Pediatrics declared an emergency in adolescent mental health because of the pandemic. Reporter Emma Franz shows us what Miss Teen USA is doing to help raise awareness. I have so many friends who deal with anxiety, depression, and ADHD and other illnesses that I felt nobody really talks about enough. The former Miss Lando Lakes advocates for mental health on her podcast. Hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of Be Bold, Be Beautiful, Be You. 16-year-old Eliza Smith features diverse voices to show that mental health looks different for everyone. This is a podcast where we talk all about self-discovery, self-love, mental health awareness. Because of COVID, I wanted to kind of open up a platform where people can share what they're going through. According to a CDC survey from last year, 63% of young adults experience significant symptoms of anxiety or depression. Reporting for Florida Focus, I'm Emma Franz. If you want to check it out, we posted a link to the podcast on usfnewsroom.com. Thanks for watching Florida Focus. Have a great evening.